Good morning. I hope you're doing well. I'm Officer Cooper. And uh, today's video is about the civics questions. As you know, for those who are getting ready to be tested on the citizenship, um, there are 100 questions on the civics test. And um, out of 100, they're going to choose 10. And uh, if you answer correctly, six, you pass the test. So for those who don't understand English, euh, Aujourd'hui, la vidéo concerne toutes les personnes qui se préparent pour la citoyenneté. Et comme vous le savez, il y a trois parties. Il y a la lecture, il y a l'écrit et il y a les questions civiques. Et parmi les questions civiques, vous savez déjà qu'il y en a 100. Vous allez vous entraîner sur 100 questions civiques qu'on va choisir au hasard. Et euh, on va en choisir 10. Parmi les 10, si vous répondez correctement à 6, vous passez le test. So, we're going to start the test. Question number one. Who was president during the Great Depression and World War II? Franklin Roosevelt, right? Question number two. Who did the United States fight in World War II? You know the answer. Japan, Germany, and Italy, right? Correct. Question number four. Before he was president, Eisenhower was a general. What war was he in? World War II. Correct. Question number four. During the Cold War, what was the main concern of the United States? Communism. Correct. Next question. What movement tried to end racial discrimination? Civil rights movement, right? Correct. Next question. What did Martin Luther King Jr. do? He fought for civil rights. Perfect. You're doing good. Next question. Next question. What major event happened on September 11th, 2001 in the United States? Terrorist attacked the United States. Next question. Name one American tribe. Cherokee or Sykes or Cheyenne. Oh, Shoney, right? You got to choose one. Next question. Next question. Name one of the longest rivers in the United States. One, Mississippi. Correct. Next question. What ocean is in the west coast of the United States? West coast the Pacific Ocean. Correct. Next question. What ocean is on the east coast of the United States? The Atlantic Ocean, right? Uh, next question. Name one U.S. territory. Just name one U.S. territory. Guam. Correct. Next question. Name one state that borders Canada. One state that borders Canada. New York. Correct. Next question. Name one state that borders Mexico. Arizona. Correct. Next question. What 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 is the capital? of the United States, Washington, D.C. Okay, we almost done. Next question. What is the Statute of Liberty? Where is the Statute of Liberty? New York Arbor, correct. Next question. Why does the flag have 13 stripes? 
because of the 13 original colonies, right? Correct. Next question, why does the flag have 50 stars? Because of the 50 states. Each star, one star for one state. Okay. Next question, what is the name of the national anthem? What is the name of a national anthem? The Star Spangled Banner, right? Correct. Next question. When do we celebrate Independence Day? When do we celebrate Independence Day? July 4th. Correct. Next question. Name two national U.S. holidays. Independence Day is May the 4th of July, Christmas, Christmas Day, or New Year Day. It's up to you. So this is the end of the exercise. For the next session, we're going to put other questions about the civics text. So stay tuned.